Welcome back. The 2021 United Nations Climate Change Conference begins in Scotland in just one week, where leaders for some of the world's biggest polluting countries will gather to renew their goals toward lowering emissions and curbing climate change. All week leading up to those talks, we'll show you what's at stake for the world's climate. And today we start with sea level rise. Sea levels have risen by nearly a foot in just over the last century, and they're currently rising at a faster rate than any rate we've measured in at least 2,000 years. This is happening not only from ice melting, but also something called thermal expansion. As water heats up, it actually expands and takes up more space. I want to show you some more visual projections for what we might see going forward. Look at this animation from Climate Central. It shows the Houston Space Center down on the coast if the world's heat heats up by 3 degrees Celsius versus this if countries around the world make drastic cuts to pollution soon and limit warming. Now this image shows Washington DC's National Park, Nationals Park rather, if we cut emissions soon and transition away from fossil fuels. But look at this. Compare that to Nationals Park underwater if the world were to warm by 3 degrees Celsius. Hey, you ever been to Santa Monica, California? Well, look at this. Here's what the famous Santa Monica boardwalk looks like if we cut emissions soon compared to this, the Santa Monica boardwalk underwater if we warm by 3 degrees. United Nations experts say we're already locked in to a degree and a half Celsius of warming. We'll likely cross that threshold in the 2030s. And while that 3 degree mark that I showed you may seem like a distant possibility, the latest UN projections actually show that 3 degrees Celsius is the amount we will warm in just 80 years if we continue on a business as usual emissions path. That means by the time your kids are old men and women, that's what the world might look like. Tomorrow, we dive into how climate change is affecting your health.